it's such an important uh, impact on the community as a whole uh, that this belongs in the hands of the people to make a decision. Northern Arizona Healthcare plans to move their hospital located in downtown Flagstaff about seven miles south near Fort Tuthill. While this was approved by City Council over the summer, a group with Flagstaff Community First gathered enough signatures to get Proposition 480 on the ballot. And we're urging people to vote no on 480, which means that it would reverse the rezoning and allow it allow that land to stay as um, rural residential as opposed to being shifted to highway commercial. NAH held their first community Q&A Wednesday evening to address community concerns as the room was packed with people wearing both vote yes and vote no stickers. NAH representatives say the goal with this move is to provide better health care to all of northern Arizona. Um, we don't get a good bed utilization. So while we might have 240 beds, we don't ever really get to use 240 beds. So when we're increasing by 36 beds, we're not just increasing by 36 beds, we're increasing the utilization of our beds. But people in the area are also concerned about the second phase, which could include commercial and residential buildings. The hospital should be in the business of health care, not in the business of real estate. The best outcome for those against the hospital, they say, is to focus on what is already built. AH had a plan to renovate the current hospital and it was a good plan and it served the community's needs and purposes in a variety of different ways. NAH representatives say before more development does move forward, they would have to take a proposal to the city for approval as well as hold more community meetings like the one they held tonight. Reporting in Flagstaff, Mason Carroll for Arizona's Family.